G'day YouTube, down to Bricks here. We're going to get stuck into a Just Build It video today. So that's right, I am just going to build this set. So this is set 60102. It is Airport VIP service, I believe it's called. It's around 360 odd pieces. Let's have a bit of a look at the box. Check it out the back. Lots of good little play features in this, but let's get stuck into it, shall we? Okay. Get the box out of the way. We have... How many bags have we got? We've got five bags. Let's lay them all out here. Five, four, three, two, and one. So let's get these out of the way. We get this piece loose in the box. We get three instruction books and one fairly large sticker sheet. Got the trusty tools here as well. So all set to rock and roll. Let's get into it. Starting with bag one. So you're going to build the little airport vehicle. Get all the minifigs together. Get three mini figs. Get this bag open. You get to little walkie talkie, so we get the little airport worker. Pretty cool minifig. Like the uh, jacket print on that guy. And we get the VIP. So we should get, where is the piece? Here it is. We get a laptop. That's cool. I like these laptops. Put in a hand. And we should get a phone. There's the phone, there's the phone. Another cool piece. Okay, there is the VIP. With the iPhone, or smartphone, and the pilot. How cool is that, dude? Awesome. Okay. Let's get stuck in. Put the guards on. Been a little while since I've built a city set. A couple of grill pieces. Got to have a steering wheel. Time for a sticker already. Stick 
take that on the back. White plate. A couple of these plates with the clips on them. Some tile. Lock it all in. Another guard on the front. Okay, now we've got to build the front. A grill and some lights and a bumper and a sticker. Okay, let's chuck that on. There we go. Um, one of these pieces and another sticker. Follow me. That's pretty cool. that on the back that's actually that's pretty cool I like that a little flashing light and put all the tires on the rims Oop. Getting close now, aren't we? Okay, I've actually I've skipped the page, haven't I? I'm good at doing that. I've actually completely missed that page. It's stuck together. There we go. Put the front on. And another sticker. So, quite a few stickers just on this little build, isn't there? That's a bit dusty. Okay. Probably not in camera for this one, so I just want to make sure I get it on nice and straight. There we go. That's not too bad. And that's it. That's our little build. That's actually pretty nifty. Let's get on to the next bag. And our next book. So, here we go. It's the plane, book two. get all the pieces out of the bag a lot of big pieces just let me come back a bit I think here we go a lot of big pieces in that bag and a bag of little bits okay and we start with this piece. And we start with a white grill. Two by four. They're nice long bricks, aren't they? So you wouldn't believe it if I told you this is the first time I have ever built a city plane. I have built quite a few other planes, but they've all been creator planes. So this is the first city plane. And as much as I love them, I've really wanted some of the, the big planes in the past. So let's get that on. But I just simply don't have anywhere to put them. I have nowhere to display them. And I don't have an airport in the city, so it sort of hasn't made much sense to really get 
a plane in the past. Put that on. And we clip another one of these guys on. And even another one again. And lock it all together with that. That's a nice big plate. That locks it together. Stick that on like that. Okay, now we're getting there, aren't we? Lock that on with a couple of these white slopes, six long. A couple of plates, one by four. And put that aside. We're going to do a wing. Start with this plate and a 2x4. And we need an angled plate, like so. And lots of big pieces in this. And these big angled plates. And one of these guys. And lots of tile. Here we go. Four of these. And a trans round tile. And on goes one wing. It's coming together pretty quickly. So we're going to do the other wing, and yep, we are. So I've got this set. I decided to buy this set because we're doing the airport battle scene from the Civil War movie for the Canberra Brick Expo. And I thought it'd just be good. I'm actually doing a collab with um, with Aussie Bricks, and he's got heaps of planes. And if you don't haven't checked out Aussie Bricks, check his channel out. You'll see his city. He's got tons of planes. But I thought it'd be cool to bring an extra plane for the show. So I thought I'd put this together for you guys so we can have a look at it and then I'm going to pull it apart again so I can take it with me alright let's uh, clip a couple more plates on and that's all just locking it all together now make sure it's nice and compressed okay it's taking shape a couple of these on the back and then because I really don't have room for it, once I'm done with it, I'm going to give it to my boy. And he's going to have plenty of fun with this, I'm sure. And put this big brick, 2x6 brick on the back like so. These little wall element pieces down in there. One of these guys. And some tile and jump plates. And again, I've missed a bit. Where did I miss that? Okay, again, I've pages are a bit stuck together and I've skipped two pages, so we've got to put these old grills in here. Oh, fat fingers won't get in there. Some jumpers. And these two bricks here. 
Now we're back on track. So now I can put these tiles on. In front of those tiles, we put a couple of grills like that. We put two by four plate. And where's that going? We put a couple more of these tiles and then we put this facing the towards the back. We put that there. Cool. Alright. Another one of them. Facing forward. More tile. And Where's that piece? Oh, it's hiding underneath here. A printed slope. Awesome. Love getting printed pieces. Put that in there. Another one of these. Cross there like so. In goes the seat for the pilot. Another one of these. His headrest. Of sorts anyway. No, it's not a headrest, it's to hold a little display. So, stick it on. Um, where's the sticker? So, it's this one here. And make sure I get this on the right way. So, it's got a clip in like that and sticker and clip that on like so and honky dory we are on to bag three as you can see there bag oh, this way bag three and that will finish off the plane Oh, I just lost the wheel, the tyre. Starting with a yellow one by four and a blue one by four with studs on the side. We're going to need another sticker. This time on a black tile. I have to say I'm really enjoying my first plane. I did have the idea of actually making this Tony Stark's jet. Thought that would be cool. Put some Stark industry logos on it. Just going to get that on there like so. What is a VIP jet without a wine glass and a croissant? Alright, now we need a four brick with Technic holes in it. We need two of those. On like so. Then we need these two high bricks. Like that. And then, look at that big piece, quite pointy nose piece on that, isn't it? And in we go with all the panels. So I've got to start clipping in all these inserts. So I've got quite a few of these. So let's, uh, we've got six of these. Halfway. Uh, 
here. So they're all done. Three each side. Yes, I'm really liking this. Cool. And we finish off with these two high bricks. And some tan. Time for some tan. In the form of some 1x1 tiles and 1x2 plate. Top there. And more tile. Oop. There we go. Plate, then a tile. Same the other side. A tile. One by two plate. And another tile. Here it is. Nice. And then we finish it off like we started with a plate each side and a one by one tire. Look at the tan, I actually think that would have looked really good if I had done that in gold. Really make it VIP. We put a two by four on the back. We put the insert in here, and let me get it the right way, you can tell I haven't done much of this, there we go, cool. Sticker time, I'm not going to put that sticker on just yet, I'm going to put it on here first, so how does that attach, just goes on like this, okay. Now sticker goes just here and it's to line up with this black line so that's why I want to put it on first so I can make sure we we line it up stickers are kind of just trying to work the angle of the sticker out So let's line that up. Oh, I moved. There we go. Let's do the other side. I can see why they're saying to put them on first because it's actually quite flimsy. Get a bit of hair there. Bit of yeah, someone's hair. Not mine. Too long. And I've gone a little bit crooked. Okay. Yeah, it's a little bit flimsy, so I'm gonna take that off now and just Press that on a little better. There we go. Now I can clip it back on. That's not too bad. And next, we start doing the roof. So I might just put this here. So we get two of these and these long tiles. Let me clip the second one on. There we go, there's one. You have to do two. Like that, and then we strengthen it underneath with a 2x4 plate. And 
and now we can clip them on. Wow, honky dory. Stick a, this piece on the back and we need to clip two of them together. Flip him over. More strengthening. Add these one by plates on. And this big two by plate. Wow, look at that. That goes right along. More one by. That doesn't seem to be. Clip. Ah, there we go. That snapped in with a click, didn't it? Now, one of these doobalackies. Clip that on. A four square plate on. It's time for some wheels. So I've got to clip. clip. Oh, not clip, it's really just a push, isn't it? Tires on the rims. Got quite a, quite a few to do here. I might just put these on while we're going, eh? Clip them on. Don't always sort of fit the best these, do they? There we go. A little bit of messing around. see it. Maybe we get a spare. Okay, so we've got the two of those and they just go. Again, that tire's not on just right. Still not quite right. There we go. And they go on here like this. And one for the front. So yeah, we do get a spare tyre. So I went and groveled on the ground for that one for nothing. Because we don't really need it. I guess that's why they give you a spare. So if you, it rolls off on you and keeps going. And then that just clips because that's a pretty cool piece. And it just goes in the hole there. Awesome. Wheels are in motion. Sticker time. Quite a few stickers here. So, 15 and 5. So we need sticker 5. Just goes here. Again, it's on these textured slopes that I don't like. Don't like to put stickers on them anyway. It's already just moving around, it's quite tricky. There we go. Okay, that's. That's sticker 5, sticker 15 is here, and it goes on that way, it goes on here. And try and get it right down in the corner I think. Too far, didn't I? I 
Uh, I've stuffed up on that one. Get the little blade out. I'm just trying to get it. It's a bit hard because I can't get me fingers down there. There we go. And the tile kind of holds it up. There. That's better. Whew. Stickers, eh? Now we get a plate and put these on with the Technic pins. And that goes straight in the side. Okay. One of these. Axle piece in red and the grey and that goes on the grey like so cone piece and then we stick that like that okay and of course we get another sticker tweezers Gonna make a long video just because of all the stickers. It's probably not a real important sticker. This one, of course, it's got to have its plain number, but you could leave that off. Okay, and that goes on there. Okay, now to do all the stickers this side. Ah, stickers. Sticker Again, not happy with that one. Stick up 14. I'm going to try it from the top this time. I might get down there a little bit better. That was an easy way of doing it. Silly duffer, run I? I should have done that the first time. Let's get this on. And where is it here? This one goes on. Oh, oh, caught it. Catch. Slide the whole thing in like so. Put the sticker on. Like that, clip him on. We're getting close with the plane. More stickers. I told you it was a pretty big sticker sheet. So we've got round stickers to stick on here. So we're going to try and center it on this big tail, which isn't always easy. So I'm going to take, if you can see that, there's a little indent, round indent. It's there. There it is. I'm going to put it directly underneath that. 
and that's going to help me line the other side up except we don't have the indents on this side <laughs> so that was completely useless information so how about just a guess eh? pretty good that'll do now put the angle plates on there with a tile and a light and that goes on and that is our plane wow I am pretty impressed with that I think that looks very cool so I'm thinking that this has probably gone on for long enough, so I might cut this here. We'll wrap this up as part one, and I will come back with part two. What do you guys reckon? If you are going to leave me here, please give the video a thumbs up. That would be cool. If not, I'll see you in part two.